Hello and welcome to another episode of Optics Trade Debates. Today Theodore and I will be talking a little bit about the Noctivit series uh, of binoculars made by Leica. So we've already had in one of the previous debates, we had all the binoculars with, that do not have integrated laser rangefinder here on the table. We've talked about uh, each series um, separately. But now in this video we're going to be talking uh, about Noctivit in particular. And I would like to start this debate off by um, saying to our viewers a little bit about the Noctivit, the model range and so on. So mm -hmm. some general properties and the model range. Well, the Noctivit is the latest series of uh, Leica binoculars. Normally Leica has a lot of binoculars with integrated range, uh, range finder. They are a completely separate universe. Uh, Noctivit are without the integrated laser. Uh, they are the latest series, they came out in 2016 and basically I think that Leica tried to do the best possible binoculars what they are able to produce. I also think they tried to do the best binoculars in the world with Noctivit. We know that this race started between Leica, Zeiss and Swarovski already around 2007 when uh, Swarovski came out with uh, their first generation of EL. So now we have three contenders here, the Leica EL, the, Leica, uh, are, the Swarovski EL, the Leica Noctivit. These are the, an answer to Swarovski EL. Yeah, everybody did it. So now yeah. we have three different binoculars which are all, I would say, at the top of what is possible to achieve. And with the Leica Noctivit, they try to, to, do, to incorporate all the technologies what they have at the moment to produce the binoculars with the best possible optical performance and the best possible build quality. So they have a magnesium housing, they have an open bridge for easier handling, they have really the perfect weight distribution so they are not heavy in the front or, or at the back so they, they have a weight distribution of really in the center so there is no fatigue coming out of, uh, of an I would say non-ideal weight distribution. They have best possible glass at the moment, so the fluorate containing glass and the HT, shot HT, the high transmission high glass. Yeah. So they, they are achieving a 92% light transmission rate even though they have a schmidt pechan prism. They have the best coatings at the moment, what Leica is able to produce, so the high, uh, high lux coatings on the prisms. They have the, um, the Aquadura, Aquadura yeah. outside as to repel water and to to uh, repel prevent, dirt. yeah, also repel dirt and everything uh, to prevent uh, external fogging. They also have this uh, high durable uh, HDR, I think, or something like that. Another coating which protects the lenses against scratches. So, all best possible technology. High technology coatings that Leica is currently yeah. capable of producing. Capable yeah. of producing. And what do you get in, in because of all these technologies? You're getting a binocular switch first of all have a really superb optical performance. So with an 8x42 you get a 135 meters of field of view, which is, I would say, a lot. On the other side you're getting a really good center to, well, edge to edge sharpness and center sharpness, extreme color fidelity and really good contrast. So you're, you're getting everything what you expect from Leica. And on top of that you're getting a I would say it's not a real term, so don't uh, hunt me for it. Uh, self lubricating uh, focusing mechanism. So I think they are achieving this with different pairs of different materials, or maybe with some special materials or coatings in, in the focusing mechanism. And the result is that even if you're using these binoculars at, let's say, minus 20 or minus 30, the focusing will still work completely the same as now at, at room temperature. So Leica often sh displays this test at yeah. their stands. But they do this yeah. every time when they have the chance they put their binoculars into a bucket of ice or, or, or somewhere where they really cool them down and then they say let's try the, the focusing and you see it still works completely the same. So it's really top notch for top notch. And everything in this Noctivit is really on the highest possible quality. So 8x42 and 10x42, black and green for now. Yeah, this is you are able to get two colors and the price normally is really, really high. So it's around 200, uh, 2,600 euros. 
but on the other side, you're buying one of the best binoculars in the world. They also feature twist up eye cups, so with four different positions. This can really be fixed in, yeah. in any position. And they, I think yeah, cool the this is probably one of the best eye pieces you're able to get at the moment. Uh, what is also really good with them is that um, because the eyepieces are so big, the lenses inside of the eyepieces are so big, you're always getting a full field of view with lenses or without lenses. And the, the eyepieces also withstand the pressure well, so really well done like I hope that everybody would do it the same. Um, but I forgot to mention yes, uh, they are made in Germany. Yeah, so they're made in Germany. They mm -hmm. come with a warranty of ten years. Ten years. Yeah. They're made in uh, in Lights Park, uh, in the new factory which Leica built. Um, and also we have here on the table some accessories which come in the package when you this is the package when mm -hmm. you purchase the. So normally you get a carrying strap. Um, Neoprene, yeah. You get the rain covers, and a really nice bag. Uh, you are able to buy many different additional accessories which are even nicer and which have this distinct uh, Leica styling and I would say the, the quality feel to them. So Noctivit is, what to say, it's probably one of, of one of the best choices if you're able to afford it. So this is something what you're buying for really for Right now it's the decades. top three binoculars. Yeah. So every customer can decide for himself, but mm. it definitely is in the top three. Some would say it's the best, some would say... It's really hard to say because yeah. the quality of all those three is so high that it's almost impossible to distinguish between them. Uh, normally Leica has its strong points in build quality and optical quality and so on. Um, but at the end, the choice is down to the personal preference. There are two models, uh, 8x42, 10x42. It depends what kind of use you are um, in, intending to have with, uh, with these binoculars and two colors, black and green. Thank you, Theodore. I think no we problem. covered uh, what, is, uh, what can be, of course, covered in the field of uh, Noctivit, made by Leica. If we forgot something, leave a comment in the comment section. We'll gladly reply to it or send us an email. And as always, like the video, subscribe to our YouTube channel, check out our other videos. And see you next time. Bye-bye. Thank you. Bye.